frighteningly quiet. What do you mean? We're both trapped in here together. This is the perfect opportunity for you to lecture me about what I've done in the past. That would be unnecessary. You've already been through enough. Is that so? It sounds like you actually dare. Listen, when you killed Solus, we had no other choice but to punish you. Our job was to bring peace, and we just couldn't tolerate that. But that was in the past now. If you all really love Solus, why didn't you go back in time? prevent that from happening. Yes, I could have done that, but that would be abusing my power. This power is a responsibility, not something to use for my own advantage. Everything happens for a reason. We must not change it unless absolutely necessary. If you're still expecting an apology, don't get your hopes up. Don't worry, I'm not. But I still forgive you. You will always be my brother, Megatronus. Nothing you do will ever change that. No! I don't want to help you traitors! Absolutely not! My Kabatacons are killed because of you! I guess I'll help. Beats being in a cell. If I can fight alongside my brothers, I will help. Fine! What more do I have to lose? No! I refuse! Wait! Wait! changed my mind. I'd rather die in battle than spend my last moments in a cage. Alright, but if you try anything, we won't hesitate to kill you. No need to worry. I'm going to die either way. Hey, aren't you going to ask me? No! Alright everyone, listen up. 
For those who cannot fly, you've been equipped with boosters on your feet to help move around in space. Everyone should have enough fuel for the fight. Hopefully. Wait, what? If you're injured in battle, hit the moon base one. Ratchet and Fixit will be there to aid you. Wow, this is really happening. Is the powerful star screen scared? Of course not. Why would I be scared? It's okay, star screen. I'm pretty scared too. We all are. I'll stay on the ship just in case we need us to die a lot of here. Understood. Everyone, listen up. This is an enemy none of us has ever faced before. We are what's standing between him and our home. No matter what insignia you're labeled as, we must work together as a team. Autobots, Decepticons, Antipods, that does not matter now. What matters is that we put aside our differences to save the Cybertronian race. If we fail to stop Unicron, then our race will be extinguished. I know I'm asking a lot, but this is our only option. Now, let's go save our planet. Nemesis Prime, you are a fool. If you think you can defeat me. I need all of you to distract him. The best way to defeat him is going inside and destroying his spark. Easier said than done. Our attacks are barely leaving a scratch. We have to aim for his weak spots. Where are they, wise guy? Scanning. And done. I sent all of you the locations of his weakest points. Good work, Cross Guy. Try this on for size, big guy! You shall all perish! Victor Prime. The Fallen? And who are you supposed to be? Leave before he finds you. No. We are going to destroy him. You can kill him with the Matrix. Follow me. I know where his spark is. Why are you helping us? My life is coming to an end. And I want Unicron to feel my pain. Since Unicron is distracted by my team, we should have no problem getting to his spark. Do you really believe that? Or are you trying to hide your fear? What do you mean? All living beings have antibodies to protect them from affections. Unicron is no different. And in this case, we are the infection.
flare! Sunstorm! The Matrix. But I'm not a real prime. The Matrix calls to you. Unlock his power. 
Matrix of Leadership, I call upon you. Give me the power to destroy Unicron. Excellent work, Nemesis. Optimus will be proud. I am no longer Nemesis. That name represents my past self, who was created for death and destruction. I am now Nova Prime. Nova Prime? I like that. Kneel down! Through your actions and bravery, the Matrix saw that you were worthy of becoming a real Prime. You are now known as Nova Prime, Protector of Cybertron. Thank you, Victor Prime. Hey there, boss bot. How do you like the new look? I can get used to it. There are no more Antibots, no more Autobots, and no more Decepticons. We are all Cybertronians living in peace. I am the Will Prime, protector of Cybertron. And this is my message to any Cybertronians traveling through the galaxy. We welcome you home. Never die when the world is calling you. Can you hear them screaming out your name? Legends never die, they become a part of you. Every time you play for reaching greatness, relentless, you survive.
How's it going, guys? Uh, I just say like, thank you for sticking with me for this long. It's been five years, five years <laughs> since I started this series, and I'm finally done. I'm so finally done. It's supposed to be done a long time ago, but now I'm done. I'm done. Um, but I got some news. I'm not gonna say good or bad news. Depends how you see it. Um, so uh, at the end of my script. My voice actors know uh, that I wrote Transformers Gen Transformers Genesis coming soon. And my plan was to make a prequel series to both Rise of Nemesis Prime and Retaliation. It will focus on the Autobots and Decepticons. Uh, it will be like, uh, focus on b before the war. Uh, it will focus on them leaving Cybertron and going to Earth. And then, you know, them fighting on Earth, the Nemesis Prime arc where he was still a Decepticon before he went to the Anthrobots. But um, you know, I I realized as I'm growing as a channel, getting more of an audience, that I don't want to just be a Transformers uh content creator. Yeah, I want to explore more. I'm getting more inspirations to do, you know, um, Godzilla and 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 Marvel and DC, you know, whatever. And it, I realized, you know, yeah, like I said, it took me five years to, to create this one series. And I don't want to do that again. So I'm not going to make Transformers Genesis. I know. Um, I know I like the name. It was something so bad. I did like the name. I like my ideas for it. And now there's going to be a lot of, like, unanswered uh, plots that I had planned to do it in this series that I'm not going to explore. Or maybe. That doesn't mean, yeah, that doesn't mean I'm done with Transformers series, Transformers stop motions. Um, I want to do, like, a animated short film or short series based on, like, the cast of the 1984 movie, you know, Hot Rod, RC, Springer, and all that. And I'll do, like, scene recreations with Transformers, but I just don't want to do another long series where I don't end up finishing it or taking a long time to finish it. Uh, I just want, I want to do other things. I don't want to be tied down to Transformers. So, 
Um, yeah, as I said, this Genesis is not happening, but I'm not done with Transformers. Um, stop motion. This is for now. I'm just taking a break because my energy for Transformers is low. <laughs> I want to do other things. Um, you know, I, I gotta finish God, Godzilla Domination. I want to do Marvel. I don't know, maybe Avengers or a Spider Man series. I don't know. Um, but yeah, I just want to say thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate all the love and support for this series. Um, yeah, that's all I gotta say. Just thank you, thank you, thank you. I love you guys. Thank you, thank you.